Yo, yo, what's up? Welcome to some sub sub up in here. I am that good man and welcome to my crib. So from the last episode, I <laughs> I have improved my crib. So I'll give you a little walkthrough. So I got a few more lockers. That's a thing. Not too important, but you know, we, we've built a bit more. <laughs> so I've now got a scanner room. That pimp accent <laughs> didn't last long. <laughs> so I have a scanner room now and I have this room which I have a tank that I can walk on because I want to feel dominant to the life forms in here. You hear what I'm saying? You're picking up what I'm putting down, whatever. But um, if I go down here, I, I've built a bioreactor. So, <laughs> so I said in the last episode that I was going to expand on my base a little. <laughs> and I've expanded a little more than a little. Um, but yeah, so I have a bioreactor. I haven't put anything in it. I've just put it there. I've got a jukebox now. So we can get some kicking tunes. It only has a one song, so but it's not too bad. And uh, I also have this area. So this is going to be sort of like my office, you know, getting professional in that sub sub world. And then up here is my bedroom. And yeah, I have windows galore. I, I want to see everything. I want to see my world. I want to see creatures that I dominate. And I have a bed, so whenever it becomes nighttime, I can sleep. And I'm not seeing anything with these glasses. Oh, also, I did my hair. I did my hair dangerously. I did my hair to look like a shark. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so there are all the creatures out there. Nothing's gonna mess with me because I look dangerous like a shark and I'm gonna scare them. Anywho, let's go for a bit of a swim. So today I'm going to be aiming to build the sea truck and that means I have to find the last fragment to it because I have two fragments for the sea truck. I just need to find the last one. So yeah, let's head off in this direction, which is where I got the first two. So I may have missed one. I don't know. I, there's probably like 20. <laughs> That's how it happened with the sea moth. It's like in the last Subnautica, it's it's like when you found, when you finally built the sea moth, you found 20 more fragments for the sea moth. So yeah, I'm going to just do a bit of an explore and see what I can come across. Oh yeah, because I have... <laughs> Because I have built more of the base, I now understand how valuable uh, titanium is. Is that a sea truck fragment? Go away, I can hear you behind me. Is that a... Okay, can you like go away? A sea truck fragment right off the bat. I'm not complaining about that at all. I'm also not complaining about those guys biting me because I don't care. Wait. 30 seconds. Did that... Did that not give me the blueprint? I wasn't paying attention. I'm getting lagged, damn it. <laughs> so, was that not the last fragment? I now have two of three. You're kidding me, right? Probably should have checked that. No, no. It's not another one, is it? <laughs> okay, well, sea truck's done. Can you get out of my way? Sea truck's done. <laughs> awesome. So, to build. Oh, thanks for that. To build um the sea truck modules so like the storage module and the fabricator module because i got them already in the last episode to build them i know that i need quite a bit of lithium to make pastel ingots and all that jazz so let's get some lithium before we go back i got some diamonds while i hit while i'm here i mean i won't say no and yeah when you're building stuff there is quite a few things that require lithium so i'm gonna pick up as much as i can Lithium is actually a lot more harder to find in this game than you'd expect. Like, these outcrops, they give silver and gold and lead and all that. But lithium just grows on its own. Why is my game lacking so much? What's this? Another sea truck fragment. I could have really used it earlier. <laughs> actually, no, I, I found the sea truck fragments really quickly, actually. I can't complain. Hey, little dudes. I'm coming up here to get away from that big guy. <laughs> Lithium, yes. It's only the second piece I've found in like five minutes. Jeez. That's a sparse resource, man. Yes, more lithium. I'm, I'm gonna get as much lithium as I can. Where the hell am I? Where am I? A thousand meters from that. I'm pretty far out, far out. Jeez, and I'm really far from the maintenance request. Where the fuck am I? <laughs> Why am I stupid? Why am I going down? I shouldn't be doing this. I got lithium. I got some diamond too. I, I don't know what I'm going to find. I So before going into this game, the one creature I knew about before going into this game was those big beckon ice worms. I haven't seen one in game. I haven't even seen gameplay of one, but I know they're big. Oh, this is exactly where I was last time, where I went down, found the eyeball things. 
Jeez, look at all the freaking lights. It's a lot of light. It's a lot of fish. That's a lot of junk. It's a long journey home. I'm really gonna savor having that sea truck because getting around is just so damn slow. <laughs> okay, there she is. There she blows. Look at the base. So last time, <laughs> um, I said that I was gonna build a bit of a crude base, but um, yeah, I built a bit more than a crude base. It's, it's a good base. <laughs> okay, load up. Just gotta wait for the game to catch up. Oh, there we go. <laughs> the game finally loaded, I didn't even realize. Okay, so I have five lithium, that's super handy. Okay, so let us make us a sea truckers. What? Please don't hit me. <laughs> what do I need? A titanium ingot, advanced rowing kit, two glass, Three lead and a power cell. That could be easy. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna mark that. These glasses are slowly slipping off my face. Let's mark that. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Um, oh yeah, by the way, table coral. Table coral is really annoying to come by, so I kind of stocked up while I was away. There's a tickle in my face and I don't like it. So the one thing that I don't immediately have is glass. And I even have one quartz. So, literally the only thing that I'm going out for to build the peckin' sea truck is one quartz. And here it is. Show me that glass. Okay, let's build us sea truck. Woo! Sea truck, sea truck, sea truck, sea truck. Sea truck, sea truck. Come down to me. I probably shouldn't be under it, but come down to me. Okay, it didn't hurt me. Oh, sea truck. Um, okay, now that I've built that, I kinda, I kinda wanna build the other modules. <laughs> I don't know how many modules there are, but I've got the schematics to build the fabricator and the storage. So, a storage module is a wiring kit and three lead. That's not hard. Computer trip and three lead. I can literally make all this right now. Awesome, actually. Wiring kit, plastil ingot, titanium ingot, another plastil ingot, and I forgot what else I need. Oh, lead, lead. Yeah, lead. Uh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I normally have an abundance of lead, and this is the one time in my life that I don't. Okay. We'll be back in a sec, guys. Love you. Bye. One eternity later. Okay, I got the last lead. Freaking, that took... How long did that take? It took 10 minutes to find four lead. <laughs> okay, bit of a backstory. In this game, lead is normally the bane of my existence. Lead is normally everything I find when I'm looking for silver, gold, anything. I find lead. And now, when actually looking for lead, it took me five minutes to find the first one and then five more minutes to find three others but i now have six lead which enables me to build a couple modules i get a feeling i shouldn't build these at the same time because they're gonna land on top of each other that's not gonna land on top of my sea truck is it yeah 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 ouch wait Please, okay, okay. Can I enter here? Please move, please move. Okay, I'm so happy I can push that around. <laughs> okay, whoo, this is fun to try. Oh, I have a reversing camera. Beautiful. Uh, back her up. Oh, that sucks. I was gonna see if I could build a battery charger because that would have been epic, guys. Oh, that's so nice. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, storage module, storage module. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be so happy with this sea truck. Oh, there it is. Back her up, dear. Oh, yes. Show me it, show me it, show me it. Oh, beautiful. Oh, storage, storage, storage. Ooh. Ooh, how much space we got? Okay, we got eight. It's not much, but it's, it's good. You know what? At the base, I have a couple beacons. Yeah, so I'm going to put them in the sea truck and take them around with me. I'm going to take around a few things with me. Yeah. While I was looking for freaking lead, I found like seven silvers. <laughs> so I'm loaded now. Oh, look at it. Oh, what a beautiful thing it is. Nice. I'm loving the sea truck. This is freaking 
This is freaking great. <laughs> okay, okay. So this is for... This one's for... Shut up. More valuable stuff. Yeah, provisions. Nice. And then this one... I don't know, but I'm enjoying myself. Okay, I'm uh, I'm gonna go exploring. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some exploring. That sounds good. Okay, so which way are we going? Uh, last time I went to the maintenance request. Let's go left of that. I don't know. <laughs> Again, spinning the wheel and seeing where we go. That's a, that's a beauty about these Subnautica games, though. There's just so much stuff in every direction that you look. I will say the sea truck is a little slow. <laughs> I'm guessing with the modules that I have, it takes longer. Sorry. Can those guys damage my sea truck? Well, I'm guessing they can damage it, but can they destroy my sea truck? Because I don't really want that, if I can be honest with you. Which, by this point, I, I've known you for a while. You know, we're no strangers to each other anymore. I feel like I can be honest with you. I feel like I can share my deepest, most intimate feelings with you. And I hope... By all means. Then I'll make you uncomfortable. Is there anything out this way? I'm hoping there's not a whole lot of nothing. In the last Subnautica game, when you go into the areas that you're not supposed to be in, the game developers decide to put big creatures there to prevent you from going further out of the oh, boundaries. What am I seeing? Is that dangerous? Are any of you dangerous? I probably shouldn't go near you. Jeez, I'm at 149. Are you okay? Are you okay? You seem safe. You seem cool. You seem floaty. Okay, you're cool. Oh, there's oh, there's one behind me. <laughs> okay, they seem they seem pretty cool. Ooh, the freaking reverse camera takes out the water aspect of seeing things. I have surfaced. So have they. Hi. <laughs> what am I seeing there? What is that thing coming in and out of existence? I'm gonna just drive backwards. Honestly, that's that's some more clearer view than the actual view of the game. What is that? Is that going out of the water? What are those? Okay. Is this just an iceberg coming out the water? What the hell is this? Yeah, I'll scan it. Precursor technology. Is this like a satellite? Yeah, that looks like a satellite to me. Lightning can't actually strike you in this game, can it? Because I'm really hoping not. <laughs> Doesn't seem like there's anything dangerous out here. It's just the big whale guys. And just some scary ambient music. Yeah, I'm gonna hop out and I'm gonna do a little exploring. Because in Subnautica, the whole point is going deeper and deeper. That was the point of the uh, the last game. I don't know, what I used to do in the last game was just go out somewhere that I hadn't been before and go down. This isn't the best idea in the world. <laughs> I'll admit to that. Am I gonna die? Don't worry, if you're not seeing anything in post-edit, neither am I, I'm right there with you. Oh, it's so dark over here. Let me just close my eyes. Uh, I'm gonna just close my eyes and pretend like there's nothing dangerous around me. Am I not gonna make it? Oxygen. No, no. Fun. Why am I an idiot? Ah. Uh... <laughs> Yay. Oh, oh, I'm back in my sea truck. That is super handy. Neat. You're a glowware, right? Yeah, you're a glowware. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if any other animals have prongs as well. Actually, what was I seeing last time? Yeah, what are those things? What kind of biome have I reached? I mean, there's a brute shark over there, but... Oh, 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 Scheissenhauer. Oh, there's, oh, there's those squid shark things. Oh, there's another, there's another right below me. That's ha handy dandy. Should I, be, sh should I not be here? I mean, this, this down here kind of looks important to me. Okay, this looks kind of important. A new thing. Please be a new sea truck module. Sea truck aquarium module. That seems handy. That seems very leisure of the game. <laughs> hey, blood kelp. I remember that from the old, old game. Hey, giant mushrooms. Big buttholes, whatever you want to call it. I don't remember that from the old game. What are you? Flower spore. Just floating in the middle of nowhere. Hydrochloric acid. Oh, please reach it. Oh, please reach it. Oh, please reach it. Oh, I'm curling up my toes. Oh, please reach it. Okay. Okay, I'm going to reach it. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, 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 get it, get it, get that. Monetization. <laughs> Three new things. Polyanethine, benzene, hydrochloric acid. Oh, these flower spores are handy for a lot of stuff. And you need three of them. Jeez. I should really collect as many as I can. A little. New creature discovered. Cool. Don't know what it was, but I just wanted to pick it up, honestly. <laughs> this is a very pretty area of the game. E precursor technology. Generic big plant one. Okay, love it. Are there not oxygen plants down here? Okay, I'm gonna drown. I just... I'll explore as much as I can before I do. I found out that I respawned back in my sea truck, so it doesn't really matter if I drown. I, I lose a few flower spores, but I can just come back down again. But there is precursor stuff down here, so if I could find... I've been able to detect my people's technology in this region. Oh, hi. No kidding. Worth checking out? I love how she's talking while drowning. So tell me. Oh, damn it. I really... Oh, crap. I really hope I don't lose the dialogue. I want to know what's going on. Okay, yeah, I lost the dialogue. Oh, that's a window. Oh, pretty. Oh, Jesus, squid shark. At least I think that's what they're called. I don't really feel like going close enough to ask them, to be honest. <laughs> oh, that's a shame, though. I lost the freaking dialogue from going down. Well, I, I want to go down and see how... Ruby. Oh, Ruby. Oh, magnetite. Oh, stuff. Okay, valuable. Yes. Rubies. Magnetite. Uraninite. Okay, I filled up the valuables. Oops. I hadn't found flower spores, freaking nickel, uraninite, and ruby. That's all stuff that was in the old Subnautica game that I just didn't know was in this game. That's awesome. Okay, so this time I'm gonna go down with the only mission of going down. I'm not gonna plan to come back up at all. Okay, follow the alien technology. I'm really hoping to find an alien base. That way I can go inside, get oxygen there, and everything is gonna be all right. Oh my gosh. Is that the entrance right there? Is that oxygen right there? Who's that Pokemon? Death. I think that was oxygen right there. Oh my gosh, that's annoying. <laughs> okay, back to the, what looks like an entrance, and I've still got 50 oxygen. I died a couple more times, but it's worth it. Yeah, this, yeah, there was oxygen right here. I literally just died right on the precipice. <laughs> so, whenever I scan these precursor technology, yeah, 8 out of 15. I don't know what happens when I reach 15, but um, after this I'm gonna be at 10. Is that armor? Am I looking at- I got a new blueprint. What did I get from scanning alien armor? Apparently fashioned from the DNA of 27 different alien species. Alien tissues, the tissues of an architect vessel. I need benzene, polyaniline, and plastil ingot. I need to make that stuff. I'm gonna make myself some alien tissues. Why do? <laughs> so, I'm on part three of this series right of this series right now. Why um? Why do I feel like I shouldn't have this yet? <laughs> and why do I feel like it should have been displayed better? Like, geez, who just came down here, took off their clothes, and ran away? Like, geez. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess let's go back. Like some flower spores along the way. But yeah. Why do I feel like I... Why do I feel like I shouldn't have this stuff yet? I mean, yeah, probably because I shouldn't. But, um... I'd be lying if I said that I'm not happy with getting this stuff. And I'd be lying if I said that I know exactly where I'm going as well. Crap, am I gonna drown again? Okay, the sea truck is 250 meters away. And I've got 50 oxygen left. I should have enough. Should being the keyword. I should actually be able to make the alien tissues while down here. I sh yeah, I should have everything for that. Oh, I needed a plasteel ingot. Well, I can make everything before the plasteel ingot. Architect storage media. Oh, so he's he's wanting me to build him a body. And I mean, that's cool. So what do I need to build this stuff? Salt! God damn it! <laughs> I don't have any salt. Okay, well, I'm gonna stay here for a bit, collecting resources that I can't normally get. Um, like the flower spores and stuff like that. It's fine, fish. Hey, hey. Can I eat you? It, it wasn't a question. Sorry for putting it in question format. Okay, cool, cool. So, I've been going back and forth, just collecting materials. So, just stocking up on everything that I can't normally get in the main area, like these flower spores and the rubies and the uraninite and stuff like that. So, 
I'm going to leave this episode here. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know. I feel like I shouldn't be in this area yet. But um, yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here. I'm going to just gather a whole heap of materials that I can only really get in this area. And I can't get in a normal area. I'm going to get heaps of materials. And then in the next episode, we're going to see what we can do with them. We're going to make ourselves some alien tissue. Um, we'll probably go off to a new area. I don't know. This kind of feels like late game stuff. Getting all this stuff. Getting a whole heap of uranite, getting nickel ore. I didn't know that nickel was in this game. But yeah, it, anywho, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like the content and you want to see more Subnautica, subscribe. I'm gonna be, I'm definitely gonna be making another video. And yeah, like the video if you want to see more Subnautica. Comment and comment on the videos. I've been doing a series on Minecraft and now I'm doing a series on this. And yeah, tell me any other games you'd like me to try. Like write in the comments what you'd like me to try and. If you'd like me to play more of any other game or more Minecraft, more Subnautica, more whatever game I've played on the channel, honestly. <laughs> cool. Well, thank you again for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye for now.